I'm Ashley and I'm a math media arts major. My name is Daniel Harrison and I'm also a mass media arts major. I'm Chelsea Jeffords, I'm double majoring in broadcast news and political science. And I'm Cassie Stone, I'm an art history film studies double major. My name is Carolyn Caddick <laughs> and I'm a... What are we now? Mass, me oh. mass media arts. Mass media arts. I'm a mass media arts major. Hi, I'm Candace and I am also a mass media arts major and I'm a fourth year slash senior. What are you trying to bag my? I'm a fifth year, <laughs> don't be ashamed. <laughs> I booked my, I was the first person to book my flight, and I booked it for the wrong day, so don't make that mistake, <laughs> but just do it right away, as soon as you get the official okay from your parents, book it, and I actually was able to use Sky Miles, so don't think you can't do that, you totally can, I mean, it's a lot, but obviously, the only, I paid $150 to change the day, because I'm an idiot, and booked my coming home day is the wrong day, but, um, and it is cheaper to go the routes where they take you to like three different random cities before you get to Juan. But yeah, don't do that because it's just anyone who did that came back exhausted. Yeah, no, I just like I don't think it was worth it by the look on their faces. They were just. Mm -mm. <laughs> we all flew, or most of us flew up to, um, I believe it was Newark. It was JFK? Okay. Well, you can also go through Newark. I've done that before, but. Um, we went to JFK and then flew on to Nice, which was fine. I mean, I one layover is enough, trust me. Shampoo. Bring your shampoo. Bring all those little shampoos from Walmart. Go buy all those little ones. The little thing. Don't buy it there. It's a ripoff and it's so expensive. And the camera. Bring your digital camera battery charger. <laughs> Do not forget that or you will have to buy one there. And nobody understands. You that. won't speak you don't speak French and you have to go buy one and it's awkward. I brought my own sheets. Just cheap jersey cotton sheets from freshman year when I had to sleep on a twin bed. God forbid I don't ever have to do that again. Um but I just brought them and then left them and because there were, you pretty much sleep with the windows open at night, it gets hot, and if I had I not had Jersey cotton sheets, it would have been miserable, so. But I'm also a diva about sleeping. Um, I think my <coughs> number one was probably cardigans, because it got mm -hmm. really chilly during the day, and it was good to have a cute something to put on. Actually, that's a good around. point, because the first two weeks of the festival, I actually had to go buy sweaters at Zara, and the last two weeks... I had to go get tank tops because the weather was schizophrenic. So, pack for all conditions. Please, please, please do not count on them having TVs on the back of every seat like I did because I actually had a panic attack when we got on our flight to Nice and there was not a TV on the back of my seat. Like, I think I really scared some people. <laughs> um, I didn't have any reading materials, nothing. So make sure that you're prepared for the worst, because it was the worst. She fly Delta. I fly British Airways, and we had Slide. personal TVs. <laughs> I flew British Airways. We had personal TVs. They were great. Oh, Delta let me down for the first time in my life. <laughs> you don't need to really fly over there with cash. Yeah, just use your card. And it's cheaper because they have the ATMs at the airport. It's cheaper to just get money out of there than exchange cash up at the desk. And my parents gave me a bunch of cash to exchange and they weren't even open because I got there on a Saturday and I guess they're closed during the weekend. So I didn't have money like the first day I had to borrow from my roommate, which was probably annoying for her. But yeah. <laughs> Oh jeez. From? 100 euro? Yeah. I lost my first 100 euro, so don't do that Yeah, either. be careful with that. <laughs> I threw it away. <laughs> and that was not good, but um, I don't know. And there was one, one student, Dante, who managed to budget on only the 100 euro, and that's awesome. It's possible, um, but not likely. <laughs> Sketchy. I mean, I love Juan, but it's... Yeah. Just don't go anywhere like, alone. Yeah. Learn your way around. You know, honestly, you won't spend that much time there. You mostly go to Cannes. Um, and if you're in Juan, you're normally hanging out with people at the residence or down at the beach. So you have to know where the ATM is. It's on your way to the beach. And then there's a casino. There's a place to eat across the street, and that's kind of it. Walk out of the residence, make a left, and you'll head straight for the beach. Not a right. 
Not all right. Make a left. Um, what about the chairs? <laughs> okay. Also, the, train the orange chairs or any of the chairs on the surrounding beach are not free. Because that's like the private beach, isn't it? You have to like walk down to yeah. the public beach. Which is where the gypsies are, so don't go there. <laughs> so sneak on to the private beach. Act like you got yeah. money, mm -hmm. yeah. you know what you're doing, just take a seat. Look for a seat that already has some like food next to it. Or like and glasses just... or cups, so it looks like you already purchased And then you don't have to things. pay for a seat. You just sit and relax. You which sit is and relax. what we did. That is exactly what we did. Because we owned Joan Le Pen. I run Joan Le Pen. <laughs> J.L.P. <laughs> Casino is a grocery store, and it has everything you could possibly need. We went grocery shopping a lot because we didn't have all this extra money to go out to eat. Just hungry. <laughs> Baguettes and Nutella. Um, Diet Cokes are cheap there in Coke Zero, so if you're like me and an addict, buy them there. Buy the bulk. Um, also, if you just ask the locals to help you in the wine section, you'll have so much more success in trying to pick something out yourself. Um, and wine is cheap. Oh yeah, just take your own bags to, like, take a tote to fill up with groceries. It's kind of weird, but it works. They don't give you bags. You have to pay for them. They're, yeah, you have to pay for them, and also they're, they're just environmentally, environmentally friendly. See, for me, it varied. Master Burger, I think, had better fries, because Wall Street sometimes won't put salt on them, and what the hell is a french fry without salt? Um, I didn't care for the sandwiches either. So. I say Master Burger. I never even went to Wall Street just because I loved Master Burger so much. And um, the guy there had, like, knew me by that point and would give me discounts and it was really nice. So Master Burger. Wait, is that the one that everyone... That's the main one, right? That's, Master Burger's burgers are better. I feel like. Wall Street had free Coke. Wall Street had free Coke, but... Wall Street had quality... Master Burger. No, 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 no. Here it is. Here it is. Go to Master Burger the first couple days. Like, oh yeah, we're only going to Master Burger. We like Master Burger better. Wall Street will start giving you the deals, and then you go to Wall Street. True. They're gonna get mad because everyone's going to Master Burger, and then you're like, oh, you want me to have a free Coke? Okay, I guess I'll go over here. It's the same. They both taste good. You're gonna miss American food. The American. You have to get the American while you're there. It's a baguette. A baguette. Two burgers. Four patties. Ooh, four burgers. Ooh, that's a lot of meat. I feel really bad now. Um, it's so good. Yeah. And then French fries in the middle. In the middle, like on it, whatever. Smack together. It's so good. It's delicious. It's the best thing you'll it. get when you come back from Cannes and you're so tired yet hungry. It's fabulous. You have to get the American at least once. Don't let people judge you. Everyone's fat on this trip. Don't worry. What is the place right about, like, underneath? Joan Le Pan. Pan yeah, Joan Le Pan. Joan Le Pan. We only discovered that towards the end, but it was good. There was a good Italian place. There's one area oh, where there's a lot of expensive restaurants. Eat there once, like Cafe Bamboo. Don't eat there more than once. Yeah, but, like, the restaurants right around um, the, the, the residence are cheaper. What is that one called that we went to all the time? Pan and Cube? Pan and cake. Pan and cake. They well, know no, us. There's one down on the corner as well. Juan um, Le Pen. Juan Le Pen, yeah. But Pan and Cake loves <clears> us <throat> and they're really nice to us. So take advantage of that. And they have really good omelets and fries. There's a place, I'm not sure what it's called, but there's Disney outside of all of it. So you can't miss it. In Can? Juan. No, in Juan. In uh, Juan Le Pen. Disney everywhere. Probably the best crepe I had the entire time. I got. But, Banana and Nutella. It was so good. It Go there. Good. Also has really good gelato. The gelato in France, get it everywhere you can because it's fabulous. Soft serve. Hey, soft serve. Soft serve. <laughs> but don't go into that place. Get, get, <laughs> y'all remember. What's the place inside, or the place behind soft serve? It's a liquor store. Yeah. It's a liquor store. Don't, don't, drop, liquor your liquor store. don't <laughs> drop your ice cream. Don't drop your ice cream. Then go in and say, hey, I dropped my ice cream. Can I get a new one? No. No, you can't. You can't get a new you one. Can't. <laughs> but they do have one year of soft serve. They do. Two I should have stuck with the one Two year of. One year. One year. They have yeah. one year of soft serve. Get the pistachio. Get oh, the pistachio. pistachio is good. I just stuck with so vanilla good. and chocolate most of the time. Get the pistachio. <laughs> the gypsies are the devil. <laughs> <laughs> the 
that's all I'm going to say. Mm -hmm. Just be careful around the gypsies. Don't trust little children. As cute as they may look, don't befriend them. Ooh, Your only friends on this trip are the people you came with. Like that's all I'm saying. They didn't look like that. Like and Ryan Gosling. I think y'all did this too. We took our beds, because originally it's a couch, and it's an L-shaped couch, and we made two twin beds side by side, which gave us more room and was so helpful. And then we used the bunk beds as a closet because the closet was tiny. Some people had two closets, but of course we didn't. Mm -hmm. um, yeah, everyone copied them because it really is the best way to do the room. Yeah. To um, two twin beds, bunk beds be the closet. Yeah. yeah. And you have the most room. And we also, the TV stand we used for our shoes. And then um, in the kitchen, we would go to casino and we would make gnocchi a lot or pasta, which is so cheap and so delicious. I've tried to make it again here and it's just not nearly as good with like pesto or something. And enough would serve like eight of us and it would be like three or oh, so cheap. So make sure to take advantage of that. Also, if you buy oven pizzas, you can microwave them and they're just fine and it's a good late night snack. Um, but do eat in the residence when you can because food gets expensive and you want your money for other stuff instead. And always keep your little internet cards in one place because mm -hmm. they have different codes on each of them. And so I would have my code in and then I would lose the card and forget the password and it was just a hassle. Nightmare. So. I had never been international before and... It's like his second time on a plane. Well, yeah. Someone... Like, the standard for hotel is different in Europe because it's... Apparently it's awesome. But I was too tall to fit in everything. I couldn't take a shower. <laughs> I couldn't fit in the bed. Like, I had, to, I had to, like, bend my knees in the shower and to sleep. So that got old. Um, but it was cool, though. It wasn't that bad. St try to stay away from the room as much as possible, though, because you want to actually be... Right. In Juan, like it's almost, yeah. Everything. yeah. There's not really a reason to be in the room other than The only reason you should be in your room is if you're sleeping yeah. or you're working on one of your assignments, but even then you're usually out with everybody else working on it. Don't be loud <laughs> past like 8 o'clock. Because it is like families there and people oh, actually on vacation. <laughs> don't, if it's someone's birthday, don't bring them a candle with cheese in it or a cheese with candle in it and sing happy birthday in the hallway. Just don't. Your ass will get cussed out. <laughs> don't sing happy birthday. Just don't. Just be quiet. Try to keep it as clean as possible. It's a small space, so work with what well, you got. If your room smells, like some people's, bring some Febreze. Oh, just yeah. go ahead and bring some Febreze. Yeah. You just never know. Try to be as nice as you can to the front desk people, even though half the time you have no idea what they're saying to you. Just smile. Just smile. Okay, here's the thing. I had no idea how the trades were running. I just followed everyone. I just went along with what everyone else did. Yeah, I didn't know what I was doing. This is the best advice I can give you. Find the smartest person on the trip <laughs> and follow her. In my opinion, I think you should pay for the ticket because the one time I did, I got caught. If you see guards at the gate, buy the ticket. Yeah. They never show up on time. Oh, uh, they don't show up on time. No. And they leave your ass. They don't care about you. Mm -hmm. It's like the millage bus or any bus <laughs> on campus, really. Yeah, the buses on campus don't show up on time. Don't know if you're going to have a spot to sit. <laughs>